Hey everyone, today I am going to share with you my small Bath and Body Works purchase. This was from the semi-annual sale. Of course, they didn't have anything that I actually wanted during the sale, but it's just, that's my fault. I waited too long. I wanted all the scents that they came, they brought back. Uh, country Apple, Pear Berry, Plumeria, and Juniper Breeze. I wanted it in a shower gel and a body cream, and they were sold out. The only thing they had left was lotion, and I think Juniper Breeze in shower gel, and I didn't want that. So... I wanted the sets. I wanted a body cream and a shower gel, but you wait too long and that's what happens. So this is what I got. I ended up making a purchase anyway. Um, I had a coupon. It was 20 off of 60. And so that's what I, I spent. And I'm going to start with my shower gels. These two don't have the um, body cream with them. I got Enchanted Orchid and there's no description on this but the funny thing when I open this and smell it it kind of reminds me of Mr. Bubble the kids um, bubble bath but it's definitely floral it I wouldn't say yeah maybe it's a little powdery but it's nice I'm I'm glad that I have it um, you know it's not like over the top it's very subtle in my opinion uh, the next one I got was Fresh Brazil Citrus. Now, I talked about this during my Dearly Departed video. I was really hoping to get this during the semi-annual, and I got to snag it. So, the description reads, Get swept away by the natural beauty of Brazil, where a lush landscape of exotic jungle and sparkling waterfalls awaits. And this has citrus, pineapple, nectar, tiara, passion flower. Um, this is a great wake me up, got to go to work scent. I really, I really did like this. And like I said, it was the one that I said that if I can get it, I'm going to get it, um, during my dearly departed video. So I'm very glad that I got it. Uh, next I picked up eucalyptus spearmint. Um, it was like one of the few things left that had like the uh, body cream and the shower gel. So that's what I, I picked it up. And I really do enjoy this one. Let me read it for you first. Inspired by a morning walk in the crisp outdoors, our exclusive eucalyptus spearmint fragrance is both fresh and exhilarating. And this has eucalyptus and fresh spearmint, really. Uh, sage, sparkling citrus, and iced musk. Very happy that I got both of these. I really love um, the eucalyptus spearmint, and I know I really I don't have anything. I don't have the aromatherapy like that. I do have it in the candle, but I don't have any of the um, cream or anything like that. But I really like these calming cooling scents for you know um, if I've been working all day and I need to take another shower like if I'm doing spring cleaning I need to you know scrub down head to toe I feel yuck this is what I like to use it's just kind of refreshing cooling type of scent and then I picked up wild honeysuckle picked up two of these I'm like addicted to this wild honeysuckle and I thought I would never be into these like florally scents. And all of this says, as far as it being wild honeysuckle, an alluring blend of bright florals dancing in spring rain. And I got two of these. I I could use this at any, any time. I don't care. It smells really good. I love this. And you're going to see in my soaps, I picked it up. I always have to pick up one or two because this is what I like to use in Missy's bathroom. A beautiful blend of fresh honeysuckle, freesia, and white woods. I love the fact that they put these on the side of the bottles now. Love it. So very excited to have that. And my other soap that I picked up was Island Margarita. I didn't get fancy with the soaps. I still have soaps from like, I don't know, long time ago that I need to finish up before I can 
start stocking up on soaps again. A tropical blend of mandarin lime and white nectar. I love island margarita. It's like just the greatest summertime scent. All right, now what y'all been waiting for? The candles. Now I usually buy gobs of candles, but there are no gobs today. I actually had two candles in my cart and then I put this one in and then it popped up and said, you can buy this one for $5. And I said, yeah, sure, okay. So I'm gonna start with the little ones first. I love, love, love this jar. This is in watermelon lemonade. Let's see if I can get this to focus on there. Why not sit and relax a spell with this pleasing mixture of watermelon, sparkling water, and freshly squeezed Meyer lemons? Well, you know me and lemon, I have to have it. And the watermelon part of it kind of tones down the lemonade, at least on a cold sniff. But I just love the way this looks. I mean, I wouldn't even care if I burned it. It's just so pretty. And then I got the $5 candle here. And this is in Brazilian Blue Waters. I don't even know why I picked this up. I don't know what, you know, it says waters. You would think I would know better. Let's see, what does this say? Escape to Brazil's beautiful blue shores with the fragrance of ocean waves, sea foam, and dappled sunlight. I don't know. It's very oceany. It's not salty. It's not like salty sea air, but it's very watery. It's got a, a real It's just a real oceany scent. Fresh. Yeah, we'll see. That might be a guest bathroom candle. Alright, so now for my two big ones. Kitchen Spice, I have to have. It was there. It was be it was between this and apple crumble. <sighs> you know, and I love apple crumble. Maybe if I can get another order in, I will pick it up, but I don't think that's gonna happen. Kitchen Spice, a comforting mixture of nutmeg, allspice, hazelnut, and caramel. And I just, I love this. I love this so much as I could burn all year round. Mmm, to me, it smells bakery. It smells like I'm getting ready to bake something. I don't know. It's, I love it. So, and then my other three wick that I got back here. I'm sorry, you can see all my can my nail polishes back there. Just move this over like this. Alrighty. And then the next three wick, it, it was just intriguing. I just had to check it out. And that was American Apple. I mean, that's pretty American. Somebody said in the review it smelled like country apple. So I was like, hmm, it's still in stock. I might as well pick it up. And this one reads... Let this dazzling blend of juicy red apple, white oak, and pear blossom be the star of your 4th of July celebrations. It does smell like country apple. It does. Um, I can see where they're getting that from. It's not like, I wouldn't say it's exact, but it does smell similar too. And, you know, show you what I'm doing here in just a second. I pulled a Shea Scents Country Apple out. Yeah, okay. I, I, I th it's very, very close. Very close. I think this has a little bit more, um, I don't know, I, almost like a green note to it. It's, I don't know. Well, because it's got white oak in it, that might be what I smell that kind of tones it down doesn't make it so bright and cheerful and sweet um, but I like it I don't know if I'm gonna burn it though because I really would like to just set it out for 4th of July I don't know or maybe I'll burn it who knows you let me know what you think 
Um, all right, so that's my very, very small haul from Bath and Body Works. Um, let me know what y'all picked up during that sale. I know some people didn't get a whole lot, but there's probably some of you that were probably there the very first day and got everything that you wanted. Uh, I might swing by my stores and go and see if they have anything left, but I, I seriously doubt they will. But you never know. So anyway, um, if you have any questions, comment down below. and I'll be get back to you as soon as I possibly can. And until my next video, take care.